So, you know, it's a really exciting time um, to be a part of the company and just joining a few weeks ago as a new chief revenue officer. It, Tumblr was acquired by Automatic uh, last year and, and what that represented for the company is you know new ownership that really understands the value of blog and blogging and the consumer who is passionate and obsessed about the communities that live in Tumblr. You know, Automatic owns WordPress, uh, which is also a, a, an incredible blogging uh, community. And so now we have the opportunity to tap into all the amazing assets that exist uh, inside of Automatic uh, from, from a number of different ways. And so it, it's a really exciting time for us. There is a lot of work to be done uh, and a lot of work has been spent over the last year prior to me being in the organization, really setting the plan and the roadmap. Uh, one thing that has not changed at Tumblr regardless of ownership is that you know there are 150 million MAUs globally uh, and those people really love the platform. Uh, and they're deeply obsessed about the communities that, they, that they're that they in on the platform. And so we know that that continues to grow. Uh, and from an advertising perspective, advertisers are looking to build connections with consumers. They care about growth and they're consistently looking for ways to grow. And so I think there's a real opportunity and space for Tumblr uh, to be in the marketplace to really figure out how we can solve for brands uh, connecting with consumers and solving for some of the growth challenges that they have and they will continue to have over time with really great creative with a deeply engaged audience and so that makes it exciting we have the, the, the incredible capability of automatic and assets such as you know WooCommerce uh, and, and, and others um, that that once we start integrating that over time is going to represent a real value for for advertisers and, and, and for consumers and for everyone in the ecosystem a big need that brands have is, hey, we need to find, you know, we need to extend our audience and, co and constantly grow our business. And, and we need to find places where consumers are going to authentically engage um, in a natural way with, you know, the stories we want to tell. And so Tumblr is all about community. Uh, it's all about people finding community. And those communities are, you know, similar communities to what brands are targeting. And so a brand has an opportunity to bring value um, and leverage the creativity uh, of the Tumblr user as well as you know the, the Tumblr team uh, and our creators program and other programs that we have to connect with that consumer to have real deep engagement uh, and to bring value and get value in, in bringing on new consumers and building their brand. Uh, that's, that's the core you know, of, of what we're doing and we'll continue to expand our value propositions but that has been a steady state uh, for, for Tumblr and will continue to be a big part of the value that we drive for, for our brands. We definitely have video as part of our offering. Um, when you when you buy a, a, a promoted post, you can really use video as part of that. But there's a, a lot of work that we also have to do on the product roadmap to look at what types of videos marketers care about and making sure that we're including that in our ad solution. So that's, that's part of the roadmap. It's something we're gonna continue to develop uh, and, and really look at how we satisfy the needs for our, the ways that brands want to tell their story, whether through video, uh, GIFs, and other sort of you know, sight, sound, and motion. I'm not quite ready to talk about the full roadmap yet, but that is absolutely uh, a big part of what's happening right now, building out product roadmap, building out you know, a roadmap for our consumer experience and bringing new experiences for the, the Tumblr consumer as well as for brands and partners who we would work with. But yes, that's absolutely part of what we're looking at.